विद मी इज अ वेरी स्पेशल गेस्ट टूडे फ्रॉम अफगानिस्तान ही इज अ यंग अफगान एयर टू द इलेस्ट्रियस लेगेसी ऑफ इज फादर आटा महमूद नूर हु इन द ईयर ट्वेंटी सिक्सटीन टुक गन टू सेव द इंडियन काउंसिलेट इन मजार शरीफ ही इज ट्वेंटी फाइव खालिद नूर इज द यंगेस्ट मेंबर ऑफ द अफगान नेगोशिएटिंग टीम दैट विल सिट विद द तालिबान इन नियर फ्यूचर टू ड्रॉ द पीस प्लान फॉर द कंट्री वेलकम टू वी ऑन खालिद एंड माई फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन टू यू इज अफगानिस्तान इज एन ओल्ड नेशन इट्स अ सिविलाइजेशन इन इट सेल्फ बट विद यंग पॉपुलेशन हाउ डू यू सी मोर एंड मोर यंग पीपल in the public policy like you and your vision for afghanistan thank you very much sir that uh, afghanistan have been in war for more than four decades my people have been suffering for uh, generations uh, however we are proud of our resilience uh, one fourth of my population and one fourth of the country's population has been born during the war and uh, this has made us strong and committed in rebuilding uh, afghanistan Uh, post 9/11 a new society and a new generation has emerged uh, and a, a, a generation that that is well equipped with the latest knowledge and technology and uh, indeed uh, as you said there is more young people in senior positions and uh, there is more there are more young people in decision making process in this country and for the first time in a long time the country is moving from an old oriented uh, country to a young one in terms of jobs my vision for my country is a peaceful independent and uh, democratic afghanistan where there is human rights where there is justice where there is social justice where there is freedom where there is uh, the, where, where we have the rights of minorities women rights these are the values that i envision for my country Mm-hmm. uh khalid how do you see relationship uh, between afghanistan and india we know that india has been a key partner in afghanistan's development so how, what's your view about this relationship uh india uh, india is a very old friend of afghanistan and a very good one we have had uh, we have a, a common culture and a common history uh, that goes back to thousands of years and uh, india's role uh, in afghanistan especially in the last 19 years have been very very important for us and uh, they have played uh, a good role and they they have contributed in rebuilding afghanistan uh, in the last 19 years especially i can name a couple of uh, uh, places for example the house of parliament and an iconic place in the in the in the capital city and that uh, the salma dam which is also a, a very uh, infrastructure project is just uh, too simple and too small uh, contribution of india to afghanistan and the most important part uh, in this uh, relationship that uh, i see is the the the, the scholarships that our young uh, people uh, receives from india we have more than 60000 uh graduates uh, in the in the uh, in the last uh, few years from india most of whom uh, who received uh, scholarships uh edu- education to a nation is uh, the greatest gift uh, that uh, one can give and india as a strategic and good partner of afghanistan have helped us uh, in 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 money uh, part of developing and rebuilding afghanistan Uh, even though we don't have borders but our hearts are very close to each other mm. uh, uh khalid uh, you are the youngest member of the negotiating team when you will sit with taliban along with your team what will be your fu- uh, focus and the red lines do you think the taliban uh, will be able to do what it did back then in 90s in 1996 uh, so that it's uh, the afghanistan is very different Uh, Afghanistan is uh, is much different. The Taliban they are, they were coming back in '96. I think they are uh, misunderstanding the reality of the ground. We have uh, a, a regime. We have a strong government. We have a strong security forces and army, and we have uh, a strong uh, institutions in the in the country. 
And yeah, yeah if, and even if the Taliban try to come to Afghanistan by force, I think uh, they will uh, f face the, 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 the national army and uh, the, the, the people of Afghanistan. And so this is that it will be unrealistic to say that uh, the Taliban uh, will be able to come to Afghanistan the way they did in 1996. Now, when when I go and when my team goes to the negotiating table, we we have a huge responsibility of conveying the message of uh, our people, the message of the new Afghanistan, and defending the republic and the the constitution of Afghanistan, especially the second chapter of constitution, which is very important for us. And that is, the, that, that includes uh, human rights, women rights, uh, the rights of minorities, uh, freedom of expression, freedom of uh, media, all these values that we hold. These are the things that we will be taking with ourselves to the Taliban and on the table. And in this process, we are giving a chance to the Taliban to reintegrate into the society and to come back and join their, their other uh, Afghan fellows and uh, have a, a good and peaceful life in the country. Mm. Uh, so, Khalid, how do you see the Indian role in the Afghan peace process? Do you think that India should talk to Taliban? Uh, India, India as a key actor in the, in the, in the in the region and uh, also as a as an important uh, partner of Afghanistan plays a very uh, crucial uh, role. Uh, I, uh, let me just uh, go back a little bit back. Uh, Afghanistan, a stable Afghanistan means a stable region. And keeping this in, in mind, any peace deal should ensure the safety of the region and our allies, and no, no one in the region, no one, uh, no, none of our neighbors should have any concerns regarding the any peace deal uh, that that will be uh, that we will achieve this negotiation. And uh, about the India, I, I, as uh, they have done in the past, they supported the Afghan people. They supported the government and the Republic of Afghanistan, we expect India to keep on supporting the people of Afghanistan, the Republic of Afghanistan, and to help us uh, to, and also support an Afghan-led, Afghan-owned, and Afghan-controlled uh, peace process. Dalman, mm -hmm. uh, last question to you. Um, as a member of the team, how has been your experience? You have been to many cities and countries, Moscow, Doha, Pakistan. Uh, who do you think that... Uh, do not want a peaceful Afghanistan, a peaceful, prosperous, and stable Afghanistan. Where do you see your enemies and your experiences in these cities who have been playing an important and a crucial role in the entire peace process? I have met the Taliban in several occasions, uh, and also in the events that you have mentioned, Moscow, Doha. And uh, I have attended quite a few uh, conferences regarding peace of, uh, peace in Afghanistan, one in Pakistan. Uh, I think uh, my experiences have been very good. In the in, uh, meeting face to face, the other side uh, help, uh, helps us to know the narratives of uh, 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 the, the, the different narratives of the, this war. And uh, it is also very important to build uh, personal trust. If you're going to negotiation with the Taliban, Building trust is one of the most uh, most important thing uh, in, in this process, so that both sides can trust each other. And this, these dialogues have helped me and my other fellows to know the Taliban better. And uh, also, my, 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 my personal experience is that the Taliban, uh, for example, in Doha, we went there and we showed the Taliban the, the new face of Afghanistan mm -hmm. and the new Afghanistan. And uh, they were surprised. And uh, surprisingly, uh, well, first of all, we told them and these are the values we hold. And surprisingly, their one was that we know. We know that Afghanistan has changed and we respect that. But uh, we have to see uh, if they really meant uh, that uh, in negotiation. Mm -hmm.
Mm-hmm. Well, thank you so much, uh, Khalid, for speaking to Vion about uh, your experiences, and of course, uh, you being the next generation of Afghanistan uh, who will lead Afghanistan after after a prolonged uh, years of instability. Uh, so, uh, wishing you luck, and thanks for speaking to Vion. Thank you very much, Sadan. Thank you very much. It's a pleasure.